Hi guys, let's understand the basic difference between oxidation and reduction. People confuse a lot between these two very common terms. So we will understand the difference between oxidation and reduction via this galvanic cell or you also call it as a Daniel cell. So let's say on the left hand side we have a zinc electrode which is immersed in an aqueous solution of zinc ions. On the right hand side we have a, another electrode of copper which is immersed in an aqueous solution of copper ions. So what generally happens is zinc ions, zinc atom here has the tendency to lose electrons. So zinc loses two electrons via this reaction and these two electrons here with the help of a salt bridge transfer to the cathode to the right side which is the copper electrode. Copper electrode has the tendency to gain electrons and the electrons that zinc has lost is gained by this copper electrode which you can say in this reaction. So the process in which zinc electrode was losing the electrons is called as oxidation. Similarly the process in which the electrode on the right the copper electrode gains electron is called a reduction process. The overall reaction of the Daniel cell is given by this equation and why I am using S and AQ here is S denotes the solid thing so this is the metal and AQ here and here denotes the ions in the electrolyte which is in the aqueous form. Also don't see the anode and cathode here so the the electrode which loses electrons is called an anode and here it is zinc the electro the electrode which gains the el electrons is known as cathode thank you